The polio vaccine was invented here at the University of Pittsburgh. Uh, in the tr it went to trials in 1954, uh, and the final results uh, came out in 1955, showing that it was a dramatic success. At the time, in the late 40s and in the early 50s, polio was a, a feared disease. Uh, so it was a real threat that was felt by literally everybody in the United States, and it was feared by parents. Uh, then along came Jonas Salk, the National Foundation for Infantile Paralysis, the whole effort using the modern science of cultivation of viruses outside of the body, outside of animals in test tubes, and uh, enabled ability to grow large quantities of virus, make a vaccine. The vaccine went into trials in more than a million kids around the United States. It was a huge trial, and it worked. It, wor it worked dramatically well. Well, literally, the church bells rang. It, to this day, it's probably one of the most iconic victories in the history of public health. When Jonas Salk was working on this, he was working at the old municipal hospital up the hill, what is now Salk Hall. He was working on the same floor as the new Graduate School of Public Health. So the people in the Graduate School of Public Health and, uh, and the SOC team literally worked uh, uh, side by side. The eradication of polio has been tantalizingly close uh, for more than a decade now. So why haven't we? Uh, well, one is the political instability problem. But the other one is that when you're getting down to the, the very end, you need to know details. You need to know exactly where it's being transmitted, who is being transmitted from to whom. You need to be able to track where the virus has gone, where it uh, has jumped to. We here at the University of Pittsburgh, uh, and especially at the Graduate School of Public Health, have already been working on solving the polio eradication problem. Our role has been on this area of how do we share data? How do we break down the barriers for having um, genetic sequences or geolocation of cases. Uh, WHO is working on this, UNA, uh, the UN agencies are working on it, uh, Gates Foundation, CDC, uh, and we've been in the middle of that. The success that was started uh, with the SOG polio vaccine has been, as I say, uh, an absolutely precious gift to the American people and to the people around the world, and, I, and we should make sure that we sustain that.